And hello all of my fellow nerds out there. This is Oracle Nerd Richie and welcome back once again to Tell Me Why. So, last episode we ten we started we started chapter three and Al Allison was not feeling very well. She was not feeling so good. <laughs> uh we just dropped some things off to Uncle Eddie and now we're gonna be heading down to the break room and wait to wait for D. I wonder how Uncle's feeling about me moving away. We haven't really talked about it. Hmm. I, I wonder that too, Allison. I wonder that too. Well, let's go take some. I've always had a sweet tooth. Got it from my mom. She baked darn near every day. Need to start being a little careful, though. Doctor's orders. Brenda may be in for it, too. <laughs> God, that kid can eat. Linda's pretty concerned, but, uh, growing boys, right? He needs the extra energy. He wants to let her in wrestling, and who Ooh, boy, okay. is he working hard? You know what? I, Damn. I can respect that. Sometimes I miss being 14. What are you having? Trout pie and uh, black radish. Ugh. I'm on a diet. Eh, a cobbler diet? Hey, shh, 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 shh. I won't tell if you won't. What you reading? Oh, uh, about that dock strike and the trouble these folks are causing for everyone else. Ugh. I hate strikes. What is this? Paris, France? Come on. It's the only way most people have to get anyone to listen. Mm hmm. Fair enough. Okay, let's just eat. <laughs> That's a very convincing animation. You are not kidding about the cobbler. This may be her best batch ever. Right? Um. We haven't had a three-pointer coffee break in a while. <laughs> you remember how that one shot of yours went wild and smashed the picture of old Chief Burke? Yep. Couldn't show my face around here for a week. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll let you in on a secret. Most people hated Burke anyway. Your dad's a far better chief than he ever was. Hmm. Let's see. Hey, Gregs. Vacation plans? Got any big vacation plans coming up? Yeah, we'll probably go up to Anchorage for Thanksgiving. Linda's sister lives up that way. But I'm also secretly planning a family trip to New York City for New Year's. Been saving for two years, and I got it all arranged under a fake email. That's really cool. I'd love to go there someday. And it's probably our last big trip before Lauren's off to college, so I wanted to make it count. I'm sure mm. everyone will have a great time. Yeah, spend, spend time with spend time with people you can. Hey, sorry I kept you waiting. No worries. <laughs> You'll never believe it. We caught the mailbox bandit. And guess who it was? Oh. Was it an animal? Hmm. An animal? Like a raccoon, maybe? Have you been eavesdropping in on official police business? Anyway, yeah, <laughs> it's a raccoon. Delos Crossing's most wanted turned ah, out to be some trash the mailbox panda bandit. stowaway. <laughs> <laughs> and this is how legends begin. I got an achievement, mailbox Anyway, hun, I'm so sorry to bail, but I gotta run this little guy to animal control now. Probably best I take a rain check. Oh, it's, it's okay. Totally, I understand. Duty calls. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, uh, I brought you a little something to make up for missing your birthday. Aww. It's not much, but... You're kidding. I love it. Did you make this? <laughs> How did I get so lucky? Aww, it's so cute. Delos Crossing's not going to be the same without you, girl. Oh, come on. 
Oh, oh yeah, by the yeah, way, I'll if you call guys, you later. If, if you guys try to get some sleep, all right? See ya. If, if you guys hear anything in the background, there's some people working on the on the grass outside. Well, there go my lunch plans. Hey, your brother didn't tag along today? No. He didn't really want to show his face around here after the mess he made yesterday, huh? Uh, what do you mean? What do you mean? Well, you know, how he went and broke into the archive room, then pretty much assaulted your uncle? Look, we're all worried about you. This isn't the Allison we know. The Allison you know? Yeah, the sweet, smart girl who'd never hurt anyone on purpose. I know you two and the chief made peace, but I gotta say, it ate at him all day. Um, uh, don't want to talk about it. I'm sorry, but I really don't want to have this conversation right now. I, I had a rough morning. Hmm. All right. I just want you to be careful. I've been doing this for a long time. And people, they mostly don't change. Even when we really want them to. Look, I'm really tired. Can we not do this? Allison, I like you. I really do. I've known you since you were a kid. You're honest, stable, and you're not a troublemaker. Tyler, I mean, if he comes down, don't let him take you with him, okay? I, I can't, I can't do this. Oh, are you okay? Please just let me go. I need air. I need some air. I've been here before. It'll be okay. This will pass. Do I have to hold space? Time your hold and release to help out. My heart is slowing down. Hold on. You're getting there, Allison. You're getting there. Oh, I got it. Let's go. First try. What's happening? Oh? Yes. Are you kidding? I'm scared. I don't know what these people are gonna be like. Or when I'm gonna see you again. We can still undo it. We can tell them what really happened. No way. It's done. That's it. You're gonna be there to talk on the voice if I need you, right? Of course. It'll almost be like we're still together. Time to get going, though. Come on. Wait, Chief. Just a sec. 
Oh, hey, uh, kids. I, um, I went back to the house and got a few things for you. I, I know how much you've meant to you. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. Oh, kids, I... This is just goodbye till next time, okay? <laughs> oh, Sam. Allison? What are you doing out here? It's freezing. I just... Yeah. What happened? What's wrong, little moose? I think I had a panic attack. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Let's get you inside and warmed up. And then we can talk about what happened. I'm sorry. This morning has just been so... God, I'm embarrassed. Don't be. You haven't had an attack in a while. What's going on? I've just been so wrong. About everything. Did Tyler say something to make you feel that way? No. It wasn't him. It was me. I failed him. Over and over. From here, it looks like you've been busting your ass to help him. You don't understand. Allie, you've got so much weight on your shoulders. With Tyler coming back and your big move, you know, maybe it's time to ease off some of this, some of this other stuff that's clearly stressing you out. If you mean Marianne, I can't. I owe it to Tyler to see it through. Do you? I don't know why you've always blamed yourself for that. It wasn't your fault. It's not true. I want to. I want to forget. Um, I'm gonna go with I. I want to go with I want to forget. I just wish. I could forget about it all. Never think about it again. Ever. I understand. Trust me, I do. But there are ways to make peace with it. You can't go on letting it haunt you every waking moment. Mm. <laughs> Look, you're not your mother, okay? What do you mean? I mean, something happened to her. Something bad. I don't know what it was, but I never left her. You can't make that same mistake. You've got to tell those ghosts to move on. Can't move on. I killed Marianne. I can't move on. Tyler keeps telling me that too. So you two agree on something. I'm just not sure I can. Maybe it's time I finally talk to somebody about it. It's on me that you haven't already. I was raised pretty skeptical of all that, but there's no shame in getting help. Please, just do what you need to, okay? I'll support you in any way I can. That, that, that's just a good, that's just a good uncle. Thank you, Uncle. Aww. How are you feeling now? Any better? Exhausted. But not like I'm about to have a heart attack, so that's an improvement. Uh, I was remembering something earlier. I don't know if it even really happened. The day Tyler left for Fireweed. Did Sam come by with some of our stuff? Hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's right. He did. brought our goblins I remember he brought us our goblin figurines and we had a big group hug yeah he borrowed the house keys so he can go out and get them he was over at our house a lot fixing things chasing off animals I know you didn't turn up anything about who our biological father was but did you ever think it might have been Sam Oof. Well, your mom and him were close, so that's a possibility, but <laughs> that would I be never found any proof, no. That would be a hilarious, uh, that would be a hilarious trip. Twist. Are you sure that's a good idea? You need to get some rest. I have to do this. It, it would actually be a hilarious just twist if it was him. For me, too. If Sam does end up being the father, I swear. I love Aww. you, Uncle. Thank you for everything. <laughs> Aww. I'll call you later. He seems very worried about her, though. Like, and he, he has every right to be worried about her. Like, honestly, I'd be worried if my niece was going through that kind of thing, too. Ooh, Delos Marine. Out here waiting for somebody. Okay. Oh, we're not. We're actually you can do this. Time. Make yourself up, Ali. <sighs> you can do this. Out of order. Go around. Uh, we can look. Uh, nah. I, I think I think I can tell what's in there. It's a garage. <sighs> It's okay, Ali, you got this. It's okay. Right, maybe I shouldn't be too hyperactive about my approach, but... Look at your freaking braids just waving in the back. Just... <laughs> oh, Dude... This is... This is just the most beautiful view ever. Like, I really like this. Damn I like it. this a lot. It's fine. All right. It's fine, Ali. We can do this. Let's do this. We can do this. We can do this. You can do this. Add it in. Fucker. Oh, Ali. I. Hello. Hi, Sam. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. I can't put any of the chain or the valve covers back on. So, uh, did you need something? Um, I wanted to talk. I was hoping to, uh, I actually wanted to check out your boat, is all. Uh, really? Yeah. Well, all right, uh, here she is. What are you doing? Ah, my cousin Billy bought an old motorboat, but that fool drowned the engine taking her out. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I told him I'd fix it. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. Um. Wait, let me think. I could be wrong. Actually, I could be wrong about that. Uh. Where's your brother? Uh, back at the house. Back at the house, I guess. <clears throat> so, uh, what's he getting up to today? Who knows? Huh. All right. So, um, I was over at the station and I was thinking about some things. Yeah? You've known us for a while. Your whole lives. You puked all over my slick denim button-up. That's a nice memory. <laughs> how's the, uh, how's the house coming along? Uh, it's 
slow. It's kind of slow. slow. There's a lot to do. Of course. I mean, there's a whole life, uh, lives in there. No shame. Hmm. God. This article about ocean acidification is really unnerving. Oysters are vanishing at unprecedented rate. Oh, um, there's an article in today's paper about how climate change is ruining the ocean. <sighs> Fish have gotten puny. Spotting fewer and fewer whales. Hey, cuz, I left you- I left you my boat a month ago, and far- <laughs> as far as I can tell, the only work you've done is, is test how much beer you can fit on it. I paid you in advance as a favor because I, I know you need it, but damn it, I need my boat. Family is family, but get it done by this weekend or I'm reporting it's stolen and I know you're tired of frown on your ass. P.S. Answer your damn phone! Um, okay. Shit. These freaking nuts. Duck. Hmm. Uh, what if I can help you? What if I can help you with, with that? Uh, examine. Hey, an encyclopedia of astronomy. I have this one. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Real detail. Oh, no shit. Uh, we have something in common. Oh. That's funny. We both like astronomy. Oh, yeah. Funny. Encyclopedia of astronomy. Impressive collection. You want some? Take them. I don't really navigate anymore. Uh. Oh. Uh. Thanks. The moon's engineering. Navigation of the ocean and tides. Oh. That's a really nice sextant. It sure is. A present for my old crew for my 30th birthday. Ooh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> well, it, it's mostly just for decoration these days, but uh, I'm a big fan of doing things the old-fashioned way. Huh? I can respect that. I can totally respect that. Oh, I know this one. The introduction will be forever burned in my brain. Mm. Your mother gave that to me. Really got me thinking about things. Hmm, okay. Oh, damn it. What happened? I busted my finger with that stupid wrench. Grab me a gauze. Should be in that cupboard over there. A cupboard? Wait, where? 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 Where is it? You didn't really point me to where the cupboard is. Oh, it looks like over here. Yeah, the gauze should be in that cupboard over there. What, what cupboard? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> here we go. Open it. Open says me. Uh, take this. And leave. Up. Find anything? Yep, I got, I got your gauze. Don't worry. Here you go. Oh, oh ouch. Sam, are you our father? <sighs> Figured you'd ask me that question someday. Hmm. Well? I wish I was. What the hell kind of answer is that? I'm sorry, Ellie. But the man you're looking for...
Oh, okay. Guess I'll just take your word for it then. Hey, you got no right coming in here, getting angry at me for something I got nothing to do with. But you were so close. Honestly, you kind of were. But you two were so close. I know you meant something to her. You honestly think I would have let you two grow up without a father? I may be a deadbeat, but I'm no coward. But you must know something. I truly don't. Your mama, she never... Look, we were just friends. I mean, take a look at old Sam. No woman like Marianne would ever think twice about a guy like me. I'm so sick. I'm so tired of trying to unravel all of Marianne's fucking secrets. I don't... I don't understand her. I want to hate her so much. But I don't even know who she was. Come with me. I want to show you something. Oh. Hmm. Come in. Come in. Oh. When was the last time you cracked a window? Uh, Please sure Bay National Park welcomes you. The household gets the household. Hey, uh, what we got in here? Oh, hey, fixable. Yoink. New collectible, the old bear. Why is there no noise coming out? The old bear is a mighty beast who lives in a beautiful ice, in a beautiful cave of ice. He is in love with the wise princess, but see, but she sees him as a friend. I see. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take a seat. Just give me a moment. Uh, What's sit. all this? Here, I uh, kept a few things. This. Your mother made that. Oh, she was a real artist, that one. Kind of like you. Swords and schemes. Oh, and I took her to see that for her birthday. <laughs> she hated every second of it. Whole drive back, she talked about how it butchered the books. She was more of a book person, as far as we know. I remember this. We got this on our trip to Juno. Uh -huh. <laughs> she saved up for a whole year to make that happen. Dear Sam, I rang from the little hotel you recommended in, down in downtown Juno. You were right. The kids love the, the whole the whole mu the whale mural. Our favorite, our other favorite was the Raven mural at City Hall. Today we took the the tramway to the top of the Ro Mount Roberts. He has wanted to hike the trail, but we only made it to the totems. Tomorrow we're going to hike the nu the Nugget Falls to see if see if the glacier still still looks what it, like what it's on the other side. Hope, hope, hope you hope you're hauling them in, in by the barrel load, Marianne. Dear Sam, most bears only live about live to 20 or 25, so congratulations on making it to 29. 
I certainly wouldn't have survived long he out here without without you, so thanks again for everything you do. Laura is a very lucky woman. If I I know you think the best part of, of your pa of your past has been erased, but as long as you don't forget the the any any Akchak rose will always be seaworthy. It just might look look a bit smaller in memory. I hope you don't get get some time. I hope you get some time on on the water with Richie this weekend. Wait, me? Here. <laughs> Wait, why am I here? <laughs> I catch everything you deserve, in include including some new memories. Happy birthday, my cherished friend, Marianne. Oh, why was I in there? <laughs> Look at these ones. Hmm. She looks happy. Hmm. She was. When was this? Why are you wearing a square hat? Oh, yeah, that was when I finally got my captain's license. Oh. Mary Ann's the one who pushed me to get it. Made me wear that stupid hat when I went to take the oath. <laughs> huh. Yeah, Laura took this one. We'd been working on that barn for months. That roof was a son of a bitch to sheath. Rain just kept on leaking into the loft. Wait, the barn has a loft? Oh, yeah. You didn't know? No, I, she didn't tell us. Is that a trap door? Yeah. Jim, you closed the whole thing up. I told her it was going to be real hard to get any hay up there, but she said she didn't mind. Do you know what's up there? I could tell she didn't want to talk about it, so I respected that. Well, we're going to have to empty it out for the sale, so I guess we'll know soon enough. Ellie, you really going to go through with this? Just like I told you, that, that house meant everything to your mama. It's, it's all that... It's all we got left. You can't just throw it away. Sorry. I'm sorry. I know how hard this has been on you. But you need to move on. What's done is done. Maybe it would help to talk to someone about it? I never tell you about the time I broke my leg. Shin bone snapped in three different places. <laughs> it stuck in my ass for a month. No use to anybody. I was so down, I couldn't even bring myself to get out of bed. But your mama, uh, she doesn't have none of that. She got me up one morning and drove me to a nice spot by the harbor. We watched the boats come in and out all morning. You can't let yourself be defined by the parts that are broken. That's what you told me. You gotta find a way to work with what you got. I think, think about that a lot. <laughs> gotta remember.
an achievement. Achievement, are you my daddy? Hey, you Tyler? I've been looking all over the place for you. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Whoa, whoa. Hey, let's get you off your feet, okay? Come on. Damn, this, this is gonna be hard for him, man. Listen, if you want to be alone, I'll go. But if there's anything you need to get off your chest, I won't snitch. You saw Allison? How is she? Yeah. I, I went back to check on her this morning. She was in a pretty bad way. Whatever went on between you two, it, it wrecked her. Look, I don't want to drag you into this. Well, I'm already in it, and you look like hell, so... I just got a lot on my mind. Well, I know one thing that's good for that. As a wise man once said, fishing is the cure to the wounds of the heart. Oh? Uh, was that you? Was that wise man you? Hey, like I said, I gotta write my own legacy. So, you in? I, I don't know. Come on, we're burning daylight. Let's go. Uh, where are we gonna go? Why go anywhere when we have a perfectly frozen lake right here? Ice fishing in November? Yeah. <laughs> it got cold way fast this year. Yeah. Climate change. That shit's gonna kill us. But hey, fish first. You can walk behind me if you're afraid, though. <laughs> you're actually serious. I am a very... Serious man, Tyler. <laughs> Let's go. I really we like still have to get everything out of the car. I like Michael. He's pretty cool. Stage is set. It's showtime. Okay. Whenever you're ready. You right. sure you don't want to go? Nah. Look, no way I'm going to rob you of your first catch in your own backyard. <laughs> All right. All right. Wait, do I actually have to wait? Oh. <laughs> Got everything you need, by the way? Yeah, I'm good. Man, I'm so going to miss this. Miss what? Just hanging out and fishing and... You know, I'm not going to have a lot of time after you move to Juno with school and the JC and everything. Mm. Right. Right. Yeah, that makes sense. So did any of the people you came up with at Fireweed land in Juno? Oh, uh, I'm not sure. Once they left, I never really kept in touch. Really? Oh, sorry. Some I, of I them were straight up awesome, react. but we just My weren't bad. that close, you know? None of them really got, like, family? I mean, I guess I got pretty tight with my counselor, Aaron, but I already have a family. Well, there's a reason we think of families as trees. They keep on sprouting new branches. And oh, uh, hey, I think I've got a bite. You got this. Reel them in. Fish. Hey, come on. Come on, pull up on the rod. Oh. Please don't circle to catch the fish. Oh, yes. Now give it a nice pull. Come on. Got yes. It. I got, got it. it. <sighs> got it. No. Slippery little. <sighs> got it. <laughs> Bravo. Let's go. We got the fish. First of many. Pace yourself. It's a marathon, not a sprint. <laughs> Thanks, Sensei. 
Oh, hey, did you want to make solid plans to hit the buzzard hole? The river might ice over soon, so we shouldn't wait too long. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Sweet. I was planning to go Saturday. I'll pick you up on the way out. Cool. I'll set my alarm to ass crack of dawn. So, ice fishing. I mean, yeah. What isn't there to like about standing in the middle of a frozen lake? Hmm. Yeah, that's fair. Wait, I want to try to get the other fish. Come on. Come on, I know you want to bite. Well, this is fun. <laughs> You have this whole fancy bag just for ice fishing? You don't mix and match. Ever. Jeez, you don't mess around, do you? T told you earlier. I'm a very serious man. Oh, oh, oh. All right, here we go. Fish, yes. Come on, I got this, I got this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wine, 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 wine. I got it, I got it, I got it, come on. Wind it, wind it, wind it, wind uh, it. Yeah! Uh, okay. Two. Okay. Two for two. <laughs> How about them apples? Oh, <laughs> nice job. Wait, I just realized uh, I... You weren't all talk. Impressed? I only see two fish in my cooler. For now. Okay, wait, hold up. I, I, for... um, I completely forgot that I said S is my screenshot button, too, <laughs> for OBS. <laughs> Uh, one second. Okay, there we go. Minor blooper fix. I, I, switched, I switched it to my B key instead. So, about last night. I don't know what Allison said, but from my side, well, I thought we were on the same page. But it turns out, we weren't. Hey, so don't tell her I told you, but last week your sister was almost unbearable she was jumping up and down with excitement at you coming back really <laughs> you better believe it look the last time you saw each other you were kids just because things have changed doesn't mean you can't work it out i pushed her too hard i know it's probably my fault i really pushed her last night i just don't get why she always has to run away from everything can you blame her Avoiding the problem doesn't make it go away. She's so fixated on selling the house. It's like she's trying to bury the past. All of it. Even the good parts. Look, I'm not picking sides here. Okay, but she's been murder house girl ever since it happened. Now she's got a chance to put it behind her. And start fresh. <laughs> Shit, I'd be pretty eager too. I don't really think about that. I guess I didn't really think about that. I've been so focused on my own shit. It's been hard, you know? Figuring out how to live... out here? You mean, outside of fireweed? Yeah. When I first got there, all I could think about was getting out. It felt like a cage. But after a while, it started to feel more like a shell. I figured out who I was in there. But now, I've got to work out how to be that person out here. Well, if it makes you feel any better, none of us really know what we're doing. <laughs> like, shit may look bleak now, but your sister's never going to give up on you. And you can lean on me, too, if you want. Just be careful, okay? Got a bad left shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep it in mind. Thanks for listening. I love these Don't two. Don't mention it. I love these two. They're, they're really adorable together. <laughs> All right, come on. Got me a third fish anywhere, somewhere. Come on. Come on. It's always rules of three. Any day now. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you should, you should always try to figure out that you're going to be 
you, you should always try to figure out who you're going to be, uh, no matter what. Uh, because uh, it, because trying to be the person that you find out find out uh, about yourself. Uh, how, how am I gonna word this? Basically, be the person you want to be, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. I I was never really that great with pep talks, to be completely honest. But so you gonna tell me what's in the cooler or what? I could tell you, or I could watch you squirm a bit longer. Ugh. You're a terrible person. You know that? <laughs> you betcha. Don't you say anything. Yeah. Yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Keep it, keep it. Sweet spot, sweet spot, sweet spot, sweet spot, sweet spot. Come on, come on. Those are three. It's always, third one's always the toughest. Come on. <sighs> Come on, come on, come on, we got this, we got this, we got this. Gaming, gaming, <sighs> fisherman gaming. Oh. Fisherman Whoa. gaming. Damn. Three out of three. Well played. Let's go. <laughs> I got nothing, that was clean. Fish huh. all the fish, catch all the fish I'm to a win. Disappointed. Catch all the fish with Michael. <laughs> Can I ask you something kind of weird and maybe hard to answer? Weird and kind of hard to answer my jam. What's up? <laughs> How'd you know you were ready? To uh, trust anyone enough to put yourself out there? Okay. Yeah, that, that is a hard question. Mm. <laughs> Told you. There's not really two ways about it. You gotta be willing to take a hit. Look, I stopped listening to the entire indie folk genre just because I was dumped at a show once. But I put myself back out there, just like everyone who's ever gotten their heart stomped on. Because when you meet someone who really sees you, you don't have to pretend anymore. Hmm. You know, I, it's hard to argue with that. Honestly. <laughs> hard to argue with that. And you're still interested in being that someone? Even after all the shit that's happened? Hey, I've got baggage too. I think it's worth a chance. Don't you? We're in total agreement. Definitely. I think we're in total agreement here. Yeah? Yeah. I get this feeling like I could say or do anything with you, and it'd be cool. I feel safe. You are. Because your sister would kill me if I did you dirty. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she would. So, doesn't look like you're catching anything with that. You want me to show you how it's done? Go for it. Caught three fish. I don't know what you mean. Hey, you're missing the show. Shit, wait, make a move, make a move. Uh Do it. Do it, Mike. Do it. You you got you got this, Tyler. You okay? Honestly, the most adorable thing ever. <laughs> oh, Allie! Uh, Allie's probably not doing as good, not doing so good, to be honest. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, 
Yeah, that's one way to put it. Hey, Ali. I think I'll just show myself out. Okay, uh, call me later. You know I will. Sorry for interrupting. No, it's totally fine. We're done anyway. Catch anything? Mostly ice, but yeah. Tyler, I'm sorry for freaking out yesterday. All of this, it's just been really hard on me. Don't apologize. I was being an asshole. We should have never pushed you that hard. Come here. Oh, <laughs> this is a sweet episode. God, why did I miss you so much? It's only been a day. I've been told I have that effect on people. You don't talk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I need to show you something. What? You're kind of weirding me out. Can we sit down for a sec? Right, what are we going to talk about? So, what is it? I was just at Sam's. He's not our father. How do you know? I asked him, point blank. Person's not my style. And you believe him? And you took his word for it? He was crazy in love with Marianne. Whoever set that fire was doing damage control. And Sam's nothing but damage. I guess he really doesn't have anything left to lose, does he? There's something else. Look at this. This was taken in 1992 when Marianne first moved to Delos Crossing. See that ladder? Sam told me the barn has a loft. He helped her build it. Apparently she never told anyone about it. And it's still there? As far as he knows, yeah. What do you think? Should we give it a shot? We've come this far. And a hidden loft? That's got secret shit written all over it. Let's go. Definitely. Definitely up, up for doing that. But I think I'm going to end this episode here for now. So, yes, and sorry. Um, I want to find those secrets too, but I kind of want to leave, leave the episode here for now. Uh, so, anyways. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to leave a like, comment what you think. Share this video to your friends and be sure to subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss a single notification. I'll see all of you in the next video. Goodbye. You say you wanna try